anyway, you know, that aside, this was a very good run overall, and it's my, it's slightly frightening to me now that I can do it to this level. Granted, Peter and Perfect Cherry Blossom is one of the easier games overall. It's the one which I can most consistently do a hard lap, hard mode, but even so, I haven't been playing these games that long. I've been playing them for less than just under five months, I think at this point. It's probably about four and a half. And I am already now knocking on the door of hard mode and every extra mode that there is. It's quite scary. It's really quite scary that I can do it like that at the moment. The, the skills that I, you know, I've never played any of this type of game before now. I've seen a fair few of them played, but you know, stuff like Gradius and, um, you know, that general genre of game, I've never had exposure to as an actual player. So, I basically learned this completely from scratch on Toho. It's probably going to be the only bullet hell game I'll ever really play, unless somebody can show me an absolutely amazing one, which is as good as this, basically. But, even so, it is frightening how, you know, quickly I've adapted to this. But there is still a long way to go. You can see in there, it is far from perfect. So, you know, there's stuff to do yet. Anyway, I am not gonna commentate the extra video thing of this because this has been enough. I can, I can edit to this point, but I think I'm gonna leave it at that. I'm just gonna let the actual video talk for itself next time. There is a couple of deaths in there, one really stupid one again before the boss, then mid boss, but whatever. I'll let the video do the talking because there's only one card which I don't capture if I remember rightly on that, so it's a much better take. Yeah, this is not counting Yombo in the middle, so technically two cards, but it's a much better run, that's the point. So this has been Gamer Cow, you've been watching Perfect Cherry Blossom on hard mode, and yeah, um, with the extension of stuff, if I am, um, if I can't get into uni on Friday at the latest, so I'll be doing my um, software engineering crossword then, if I can't get in by Friday, then I will probably edit a Sonic Colors video. I have a few to do, so... If I can't get in on Friday, then I will edit a video then. If not, well, you might see random Toho stuff if I can't do it, because, you know, Toho doesn't take any real editing time to do, it just takes time to save. Which is, you know, I can do other stuff whilst it's saving, so it's not a huge issue. But, no promises whatsoever. However, if I can do it, then I will because I have been doing more videos than I expected to because of snow days and yeah I don't think it's gonna stop anytime soon so see you guys in the extra video